Hello everyone, in this video we are solve this interesting maths Olympiad question. It is a radical maths Olympiad question. This question is square root 2 power square root x minus square root 2 of power square root y is equal to 28 x and y is equal to what? How to solve this maths question? So let's start. Our question is square root 2 and power is square root x minus square root 2 power is square root y is equal to 28 yes this is our question then this equation becomes i can say it will be look 2 so square root 2 it will be 2 to the power half yes 2 to the power half it will be square root 2 then i use here is whole to the power square root x minus and here is also 2 to the power half yes then here is power square root y is equal to 28 yes then according to exponential law i can say both power if i both multiply both power this time i can say easily this equation becomes look it will be 2 to the power square root x and here is 2 this time this it will be square root x over 2 minus 2 to the power square root y over 2 this 2 is equal to 28 yes so at this moment look here is 2 to the power square root x over 2 and 2 to the power square root y over 2 we'll let look square root x over 2 it will be m and well let here is square root y over 2 it will be n yes then this equation becomes look 2 to the power square root x over 2 we are let it is it will be m so i can say it will be m minus 2 to the power look here is square root y over 2 we are let this is equal to n is equal to 28 yes so we'll find out here is 2 to the power m minus 2 to the power n is equal to 28. Look, here is 28 is a positive number. So square root m obviously greater than, uh, sorry, 2 to the power m is greater than 2 to the power n. So I can say easily, according to this equation, 2 to the power m always greater than 2 to the power n. Yes. Then I can say easily, look, in this expression, here is m always greater than n yes then i can say here is let m it will be this m it will be n plus k yes now in this expression to the power m i can say to the power m it will be to the power m it will be n plus k minus 2 to the power n is equal to 28 yes now i can say really according to exponential law you know that a to the power m plus n according to this law a to the power m times a to the power n according to this law i can say really this equation becomes 2 to the power n times 2 to the power k minus 2 to the power n is equal to 28 yes <coughs> now here is 2 to the power n is common so 2 to the power n so this divide this it will be 2 to the power k minus this divide this it will be 1 is equal to 28 yes look here is 28 so i can if i find out the factor uh, here is 28 i mean 28 divide 2 it will be 14 14 divide 2 it will be 7 so i can see really, this 28 it will be 2 times 2 times 7 yes so according to this case i can say really, it will be 2 to the power n times 2 to the power k minus 1 it will be 2 to the power 2 times 7 look 2 to the power 2 it will be 4 4 times 7 it will be 28 look <coughs> in this expression i can say really, it will it will be even number yes it is even to the power uh, something it is always even look to the power something it is always even but 
something is minus minus one it will it will be always odd number so to the power k minus one it is always odd yes and in this expression it will be even and it is odd yes so if i compare in this equation i can easily to the power n it is always to the power two then to the power k minus one always seven yes <coughs> Now, in this expression, I can say here is base is same, so exponent is equal, so n is equal to 2. And here is, look, 2 to the power k is equal to 7 plus 1, it will be 8. Look, in this expression, you know that, recall, n, it will be square root y over 2, yes. And I can see that if I put this value in this expression, we will find out here is square root y over 2 is equal to 2. Then if I multiply both sides by 2, we will find out square root y is equal to 4. Then if I use both sides whole square, we will find out y is equal to 16. I use both sides whole square. So we will find out y is equal to 16, but x is equal to what? So look, here is 2 to the power k is equal to, look, 8 it will be 2 to the power 3 yes 2 to the power 3 2 times 2 times 2 it is 8 then i can say here is b is same so i can say exponent is equal so k is equal to 3 but remember that we'll let we'll let look recall m is equal to n plus k we'll let this so i can say k it will be m minus n so i put here is m minus n is equal to 3 yes then I can say really, here is m is equal to 3 plus n. Yes. Because of that, I just move on this and this side. So so m is equal to 3 n and it will be 2. So if I put this below in this case, we will find out here is m is equal to 5. So recall m it is square root x over 2 first of all we are recall m is equal to square root x over 2 so if i put this value in this case we'll find out square root x over 2 is equal to 5 then i can see that square root x is equal to 10 i multiply 5 times 2 it will be 10 then if i use both side square then we'll find out x is equal to 100 this is the value of x in this maths olympiad question let's check out our question our question square root look first of all we we'll find out x is equal to 100 and y is equal to 16 yes <coughs> but our question square root 2 and square root x minus square root 2 square root y is equal to 28 yes then i can easily this equation becomes 2 it will be square root 2 and square root 100 minus square root 2 y square root 16 is equal to 28 then i can say really, this equation 2 to the power 1 over 2 look 2 to the power 1 over 2 it will be square root 2 then it will be 10 square root square root 100 it will be 10 minus 2 to the power half and it will be 4 is equal to 28 then i can say really, it will be 2 to the power 5 10 divide 2 it will be 5 minus 2 to the power 2 is equal to 28 then i can say it will be 32 minus 4 is equal to 28 so you know that 32 minus 4 it will be 28 is equal to 28 so x is equal to and red and y is equal to 16 this is our right answer because of that left hand side and right hand side is equal thank you all if you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel for other interesting video goodbye take care